Hi guys, and welcome back to another episode of, of Flip a Coin Productions, and we're tasting stuff again today. And um, again today we have Corvus, the only dead person we know. Okay, so we're gonna start off my day with a little bit of spice. Here. Come on, Corvus, stick your hand in there. <laughs> Time to get a little used to it. Yeah. Okay. Right. Theme for today: snacks. More, more usual. Our, our, our things are snacks, but this is different. This is actual snacks snackage territory. Yeah, like stuff you eat at like what three o'clock later on in the day. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, what do we have first? First, we have something that we tried. Well, we tried something similar to it last time. They know what they're doing, people. Lays knows exactly what they're doing. They've made it. They've made these flavors to taste exactly like the meals they're representing. And that that Szechuan chicken that was great. Tasted everything. But right now we have kettle cooked Indian tikka masala. Heard a lot about tikka masala. Never tasted it myself personally. So hopefully this is a good representation of it. Um, but you know, everybody seems to like it, but I'm not really one for trends. But what do you think about it, Carvis? You think it'll taste good? Anybody? Uh, have you had, has anybody ever had tikka masala before? No. There's no Indian restaurants in our area. Actually, I, I think there is. It I've is. been to yeah. some Indian restaurants like in Florida. So, and from my experience, they were pretty good. So you could. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's get these open. All right, let's let our guest get the first chip. Alrighty. I got chips stuck together. Okay. Okay. It smells spicy. It has All some right. spice to it. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's very spicy. It has a lot of seasoning on it. I got two chips <laughs> stuck together. All right. You ready? Ready. All right. Let's go. Noah. You know I like it. You know what? If it, was, if it was like the regular chips, I probably wouldn't have liked it, but the kettle, nice aftertaste. Sealed the whole thing together. Real, it's like real meaty. But you know like some of them type of meats that dissolve? Yeah. Yeah, it tastes like one of them. Like the Vermont. Yes, the Vermont oh. beef sticks, yes. But that was great. I okay. Like it. So we got a couple, we got two things today that are kind of reminiscent of our first episode. I remember in the first episode, he had me try wasabi-flavored peanuts by this brand. By Blue Diamond. Blue Diamond. This one happens to be the Old Habanero Barbecue. Hopefully, flavor. this is better than the wasabi now, peanuts. Now, being from the South, we like spice. Yes, we do. And we like barbecues. Cookouts, crawfish, yes. All right. Take me one. one I don't know how it's going to taste. Right. I got some habanero smell there. It smells a bit spicy. Ready? Yeah. Set. Yeah. No spice. No spice at all. How much barbecue either? Nah, not just sweet. The just the barbecue. No, I mean, almonds are like really kind of sweet a little bit already. So, it just tastes like almonds with a pinch of spice just a little bit but not spice spice just flavor so next we have regular toast guys yeah we're gonna try regular toast we're gonna be trying regular toast wait none of us have ever ate toast before i ate fried toast you ate fried no but seriously what is toast we're gonna be trying some of these bone maman 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 mon, mon, mon. yeah bone maman reserves oh uh, this one is the apricot reserve right here okay. And this is strawberry. And in the South, we're big on preserves, jellies, jams, of any type of flavor, really. All right, let's get these open and try them. God. All right. Ooh. That popping sounds good. All right. If I was use that. I'm just gonna try a bit. Oh, oh, we were going for the um that one first, huh? Uh-huh. Okay, give me a sec. Okay. Sec here. 
We're so uncom we're so like out of sync today. Yeah. That's fine. So this is the strawberry vanilla. <coughs> yeah, this is strawberry. Alright. Alright. Let's get it. Sweet, but not so sweet that I have a headache. Sweet, just the right amount. I think that raspberry. It tastes good, really good. Not yeah. bad, really good. You know, I, okay. So this next one is apricot. Never had apricot before. Okay, go ahead. Let's try it. Okay. I already got mine ready because I thought we were going apricot first, but darn it, Carlos. But uh, that's my mistake. I'm gonna go ahead and bite the spread here. So I can. All right. Okay. Now I got yours. Yeah, I got Waiting on cars. Yep. Okay. All right. Ready? Yeah. Let's go. Peachy. Sweet. Again. Like. That's pretty good. Like the right amount of sugar that we put, you know, in our Kool Aid, like. We mean, a lot. We, we mean too much? Too much is always a good. Well, it's not Kool-Aid if you can't taste the diabetes guy. Exactly. Then it's not Kool-Aid at all. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Alright. So, reminiscent of our very first episode. We've had this brand before and we had a problem we had with it being a little before. bit. This is the Lorena. 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 I hope I'm pronouncing oh. that right because it's French. Yeah, it's I, French. I said it Italian. Here, Carvis. You wanna? You know what I'm saying? That what what flavor that is? This is apparently blood on what it was kind of sounds ominous. Uh, I, I think I, I think like it's it. gonna taste like blood. I hope it tastes like blood, or like at least tiger blood. I love tiger blood snow cones. Yeah, that awesome. sounds pretty good. All right, so wanna pop that open, Carvis? All right, hopefully I remember. All right, wait, get Carvis. Wait, 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 this glass? Yeah. No, no. Wait. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, it's like this. Yeah. You're like this? I'm so right there. I got Hold you. on. Yeah, right. pop it. Jeez. Okay, so y'all were trying to set me up. Oh, yeah. It's quite possible was, we were trying to set you up. It was smoking, too. I like that. Fortunately for you, you couldn't get it. I think you were playing us. You I think you knew us. how to open it, and you were just like, nah, I'm going to let them open it. Nah, I really didn't know. All right. Doesn't smell like blood. Doesn't. Doesn't look like blood. Well, it's a looks fruit. like straight orange. But fruit does bleed. It does technically. Yeah. So let's go ahead and try this. Oh boy. All right. One, two, three. I got one thing to say about. In this. all seriousness, I know what a blood orange is, and that tastes like a blood orange. Who loves orange soda? Kale loves orange soda. Is it true? I do, I do, I do. <laughs> I like it. It's nice. I like it. It's good. All right. It tastes like a like a good Fantana, like a, a little bit extra sugar. Good Fantana. Good, good Fantana. Good Fantana. All right. Well, that's all we have today, guys. So, be special every single day, every single way. Bye, guys.